What is up guys, it's your boy Mr. Crush and hope you guys are having a good one and um, just wanted to make a little quick update here on all the videos and uploads that I'm going to be uploading here in the next coming days and weeks um, now that the Division beta is over uh, if you haven't, if you didn't get the chance to play it, I mean, if you played the closed alpha and the closed beta then I don't know if you missed anything or not but I was unfortunate to not uh, be able to play it uh, during that time because my PC was down and I wasn't invited into the closed alpha so I was very anxious to try the game uh, when the closed uh, open beta was open last weekend and I gotta tell you it was not what I expected I had more fun than than I thought I would have like I honestly thought that you know, it was just, oh, just pick up a rifle and just run out there and just shoot everybody, you know. But, I mean, you can have it that way if you want to. But, you know, as far as uh, the people that I play with, uh, my friends and everything, the people in my group, I mean, we had a good time. I mean, I had more fun than I thought I would have. And I'm really looking forward to it because for this beta to drop at a perfect time that I've been uh, considering on, like, trying to figure out what... What game would be next to buy or to you know the purchase will be my more beneficial purchase so the division will be it and um i hope you guys enjoy some of my videos that i've been uploading uh i did performance tests for the uh division on i maxed out everything that i have and my specs will be listed in those videos as well i did it on grand theft auto as well um and i just re-downloaded shadow play i mean shadow play uh what's it called watchdogs i just re-downloaded watchdogs so i'm gonna do uh do a little test on that you know I, my system runs pretty well with it and you know i'm not trying to push it i don't overclock anything i don't mess with any of that stuff because i'm not really familiar with it and plus i just don't want to do it i mean i know some people you know who are really big into overclocking but anyway um I did some Insurgency videos. I went back to play Insurgency. I'm trying to figure out how to get into the World War II Infamy. Um, some squad videos are coming up. And I've been watching a whole lot of Squad League uh, streams on YouTube and on Twitch. So if you guys are into my squad and you, you want to see some Squad uh, League, which is more like a squad competitive scene. Where, you know, you have two big squads. Or I think there was an event where it was four squads from Project Reality, if you're familiar with that. And four big squads from, like, uh, not four, but just, just four from Squad. And then they just clashed in a certain map. But it was just cool. It was awesome. I like watching it. Um, I, uh, a guy that I met on there on Squad, his name is Rusty. I think him and some other guys host that, too. Uh, Grand Theft Auto videos. Uh, I'll just do some here and there, you know, just, I really want to make Grand Theft Auto look so nice and crisp, and I try to go do the Pinnacle 5 mod, but apparently that mod's been shut down, uh, according to one of my friends, uh, maybe I'll look around and see, but uh, I'm trying to learn how to do the mod, modding with a single player, so if anybody knows how to do it and would like to help me, like, step by step without me having to put the mods in my actual .exe file, I don't want to do that, I want to do a secondary, secondary, so just let me know. And I, you know, I would appreciate that. Um, and some other games like Call of Duty, um, Black Ops 3. For some reason, I was so I was I was able to play Rainbow Six Siege in a beta, and no problem at all. And then when the game drops in December, I had a problem with my NAT tie, so I contacted you know my internet provider, and they said something like they don't support Ubisoft. And then I I was like, wow, really? You know, I was shocked. But anyway, after I did their step by step, and then Ubisoft has sent me an email about some some things, some options I can run. It automatically just made a certain like most some of my games have strict NAT type, and I'm just like whatever, you know. But I can run I can run Rainbow Six Siege on um, through my phone. I tell it through my phone. So if you're interested in any of these games or any other new games, just let me know, and I'll, I'll be glad to go and check it out and and, and try it out. But anyway. I do have some Arma 3 news, uh, Arma 3 Exile from the old server um, for the Jaeger House. We will be going back there. It's a first person hardcore server now. There's a lot of new mods and some of the old mods from back then, but they have a lot of new list of mods. So if you're interested in that, let me know. But uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, I did a, a performance test, like a benchmark, and it's called Va uh, Unigen Valley Benchmark. I'll leave the link in the description too if you want to test it out too. A buddy of mine, OSAC Gaming, uh, let me know. There's also another one called Heaven Benchmark. It's from the same uh, from the same uh, link, and you can try it out if you want to. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it, and uh, stay tuned for a lot of uploads and videos uh, from all the games that I enjoy playing. And thanks for watching. And it's your boy Crush, and I'm out. Peace.